Hey there, Bull, and welcome now to Wednesday. Well, sunny and cool today for the Tauruses. The moon is now in your sign, which is great. Your emotions and your ego working side by side. So you have the strength of your ego behind your emotions, so you're feeling really good. You have the passion of your emotions behind your ego, so you're feeling really good. And I've been noticing, actually, just doing astrological research, that in a sunny and cool period, a lot of times people end up feeling a little randy, just so you know, especially the Tauruses. So there's a subtle chance of randiness today as the moon moves through your sign. Now, don't be too surprised if you don't get called into soul service. You know what that means, that you are holding space for someone to produce something, to make something. Some people may come to you saying, can you help me make this? Can you help me grow this? Can you help me with this? What are the next steps? That's what Tauruses get always that question. What's the next step? What do I do next? Tauruses intuitively understand what to do next, and that's why you are the producer and you get things done, Tauri. As in around the sun, we have no ruling planet today, but the sun has transited into chapter three of Sun and Leo. We're in our final 10 days now of a home, family, and self-nurturing transit. That's what Tauruses are doing. They're upgrading the way they take care of themselves, upgrading how they live. That's what the topic of is with Sun and Leo and settling in to their living situations. Now today, since there's no ruling planet, the best thing to do is just to hold space. Sit back, maybe even on your couch, maybe in a lawn chair, sipping a lemonade and thinking, what do I want for a home? What do I want for a family? What do I really want to make in this next 10 days and set into motion? Now, Mercury. Mercury, if you don't know, the focusing agent of our intellect, has moved ahead into Virgo and begins to conjunct Saturn as of today. Saturn's been working with Tauruses since September of 2007 to get them back in touch with their inner child, what they really want, what really makes them excited, and move forward with their personal dream path. This is a creative personal dream path. So you're going to start thinking really seriously in the next few weeks about getting on that path and what it will take and being very focused and being very responsible. And the universe is not going to do this randomly. Mercury will cross over Saturn now, retrograde in September, and cross back. So whatever plans you make, you will rethink those plans. Then you will cross for one more time and set those plans in motion. But the good news is, by the time the sun is in Libra, I expect Tauruses to be divided in two camps. There's the Tauruses who actually did the soul work, and their personal dreams will build momentum and begin to take off. And there'll be the Tauruses who have not done their soul work, and they're going to watch the bus pass them by and probably regret it for 30 years. That's right, because Saturn only comes back to this spot in 30 years. So do your soul work, Taurus. It's not too late. All right, that's all I have for the day. I'll see you folks tomorrow with more. Live, love, be. Soul.